I thought we'd have a change of scene this week, so I've come up to the shop to remind you what it all looks like. Um, today's going to be about the classic trench, because I figured that most of you will have at home in your wardrobe a very classic trench. This one I've had, I think for about 10 years, it's by Burberry. And what I've done is I've taken off the original belt and I've added this Dries van Noten grow green belt. Now it doesn't have to be this belt you use, it could literally be a thick, thick piece of grow green ribbon. So it narrows in the waist here and then I've just done a cute bow at the back. These grow green belts are great for anyone who's got that kind of classic hourglass figure and who wants to define their waist. You can put them on dresses, baggy tops, anything, anything to cinch it in. If you want to be a bit fancier, this is another belt by Dries van Noten and that's just going to add some very on-trend embellishment to your classic trench. My third trick you might remember from week two. So uh, this is all about adding a scarf to your trench for a bit of softness. So this is by Fabiana Filippi. That's one of the benefits of coming up to the shop to do this because I can borrow the accessories. Um, so nice kind of tonal neutral scarf, adding a bit of softness to the severity of the trench. And then I'm going to add this belt trick, which I showed you again, I think on week two. So I'm just doing a kind of loose tie on the belt. This was a look that actually did go down the Burberry runway um, one season, a few seasons ago. And I just remember thinking um, how chic it looked and how much softness it added. So my next one I need to change for, so bear with me, please. I'm going to add a hoodie to the mix. This hoodie is by Massimo Dutti, uh, just to prove that I do do the high-low thing and I shop on the high street and mix it with my good pieces. So classic cream hoodie. I'm going to keep my hoodie sleeve out and I'm really going to ruffle up my trench sleeve. I'm going to do the same on the other side, make sure my hoodie is out. Um, pull up the sleeve a bit so you've got lots of hoodie sleeve there and just leave it open for a kind of more casual look. Now I hope you can see I've got my trainers on the bottom which just adds to a kind of more of a sport luxe look with a really classic coat. So that's the hoodie. My final one is a denim jacket. So again, bear with me while I pop this on. This denim jacket I bought deliberately so it was on the small side because I knew that I wanted to wear it as a layer underneath things. So it does look a little bit boyish and a little bit too small for me, but that's meant. So I'm doing it up. It's a little bit cropped as well. And I'm going to put my trench over the top. Now this is a look that was made very popular by Alexa Chung a few seasons ago, but I think it is just a fashion classic. Um, so make sure you see your denim collar. Um, I would also bring up your cuff. And then if you want to close the coat, use the actual belt, but don't use it kind of through the belt loops. Just do a kind of loose sort of fashion knot. And there you go. That's your denim jacket. Also adds a much needed in April bit of warmth to what's quite a lightweight coat. I wanted to show you just before I finish how the denim jacket can work under a couple of other lightweight summer jackets, just in case you're not a trench kind of girl. So this is my trusty 
biker, which I think we saw last week with the scarves. And this looks great layered with the denim underneath. Um, just looks a little bit rock and roll, but a little bit preppy at the same time. And then finally, because I feel that I have to end on a bit of colour, because I keep banging on about wearing colour. I know loads of you have got these Harris Wharf coats because we sold them for a few seasons and we had them in a rainbow of colours. I've got this red one, I've also got a green one. Now these are great coats, but they're quite lightweight. So what I do at this time of year is I pop my denim jacket underneath. Again, I'm going to bring the cuff up, bring the cuff up on this side, just check my sleeves out. And I can guarantee you that if you pop on a bit of colour like this today and a spring coat as opposed to your winter coat, you're going to feel much better. Thank you for watching again. We'll see you next week and we will get, together, get through this together in style.